All right, what we're going to do is I'm going to do two demonstrations of eyes. Carving an eye on the flat plane and carving an eye in an eye socket. I've already started both of them. I'm going to open this socket up just a little bit here. Use a big, uh, big gouge. The eyebrow is going to be way up in here just to give you some reference. First, I'll take a V-tool. I want to angle the V-tool. Everything above the eye goes up and everything below the eye goes down. So carving up this way and then carving down this way. I start at my halfway point and I come in and I go down. I'm going to flip it around and I'm going to carve the other side, still carving up. And it comes out in that crease. Now the same way here, I'm going to start in the center and go down. I'm going to start in the center and go down. Now we're on the bottom, everything's going to get carved downward. So we carve down, and then we come in here, and that big eye bag is there. That's all done with the VTOL. Now you come in here and you clean this up. I want to go in the middle there, and I want to carve a triangle. Everybody talks about one third, one half, one quarter. What I do is I just come back toward the center of the eye and cut that triangle out of there. Same way here. And I'm going to come back toward the center of the eye. Make sure we get all that out. Now if you look at that, the eye's already taken shape. All we got to do at this point is do a little bit of cleanup where our VTOL was. In there. And then we're going to come out and we're going to frame the rest of this eye. We're car still carving upward. And we're going to take a wedge cut and get those pieces out of there, like so. And that's a simple eye carved directly into the flat plane. Here on the gouged out eye, or the eye socket, is about the same way I want to carve that upper part of the eyelid, and I'm not using a pencil, I'm just eyeballing it to fit into my eye socket. Same way cut down, I'm just going to clean that up with the VTOL to get that piece out. And I'm going to come in here and do the same thing, I'm going to put the bottom part of the top eyelid. Same way, just cut that piece out there. Clean up with a knife is a lot easier. The bottom part of the eyelid, or the top part of the bottom eyelid, and then you got the bag underneath the eye. Same way in here, you come in here with your knife, you get that triangle cut out, coming back toward the center. Same way here. And we come back toward the center of the eye. Now if you're cutting down and you're cutting up, the triangle is slightly larger than the opening, so you may have to manipulate that piece out. Same way here. Come in here and just add some highlights or shadowing in there. Just clean that up. Same way on the bottom. Just create a little shadowing. Stop cutting the V-cut. Now when I do this part down here, I come into the eye. I didn't show you up here, but I come into the eye. I do a little scoop cut, which is nothing more than a relief cut. And then I accentuate that bag by giving it some detail. Then with those eyes,
very simple. Thank you.